Is it time to buy or sell Apple stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Apple. Our initial report was published on our website on Thursday, June 15, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since March 13, 2023, our system has ranked Apple as a hold slash accumulate, giving it a score of 0.00. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. During this period, the stock has outperformed our expectations, with a gain of 23.62% since we first recommended buying Apple 67 days ago. This translates to an average return of 0.35% per day since it was listed as hold slash accumulate. A score of zero indicates that our system anticipates high volatility and risk for the following trading day. Given the latest developments, we are unable to determine the stock's next direction, as it could go either way. The stock lies in the upper part of a narrow and strong rising trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good selling opportunity for the short-term trader as reaction back towards the lower part of the trend can be expected. A breakup at the top trend line at $186.90 will firstly indicate a stronger rate of rising. The current 3-month trend suggests a potential 15.88% change over the next 3 months, with a possible return between 11.13% and 16.43%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a 11.77% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 19.51% and 14.95%. This translates to a price range of $149.72 to $213.81 after a year. Our latest daily update for Apple includes the headline, Evaluation of Apple Stock Downgraded After the Last Trading Session. The Apple stock price gained 1.12% on the last trading day, Thursday, June 15, 2023 rising from $183.95 to $186.01. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 1.48% from a day low at $183.80 to a day high of $186.52. The price has risen in 6 of the last 10 days and is up by 3.29% over the past 2 weeks. Volume has increased on the last day along with the price, which is a positive technical sign, and, in total, 9 million more shares were traded than the day before. In total, 63 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $11.64 billion. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $186.52, and the lowest price was $124.17. Currently, the price is 0.27%, or $0.505, below the 52-week high, and 18.51%, or $42.25, below the all-time high on August 30, 2018, when the price reached $228.26. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Friday, February 3, 2023, DA Davidson set a price target of 173. On Friday, February 3, 2023, Raymond James set a price target of 170. On Friday, February 3, 2023, Wedbush set a price target of 180. On Friday, February 3, 2023, Rosenblatt Securities set a price target of 173. On Friday, February 3, 2023, DA Davidson set a price target of 173. Analysts have given Apple stock a general strong buy rating. They rate the P.E. ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been identified for Apple. 
The Apple stock holds by signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $182.34 and $175.20. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Wednesday, April 12, 2023, and so far it has risen 16.18%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Volume is rising along with the price. This is considered to be a good technical signal. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence by signal. Pivots by signal 46 days ago. Bollinger by signal one day ago. Short term moving average sell signal eight days ago. Long term moving average sell signal not applicable days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages holds a sell signal. If we look at the 12 month chart we see short moving average sell signal 37 days ago. The long-term moving average, sell signal 97 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 89 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Apple Apple finds support from accumulated volume at $179.58 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock is usually traded at a good volume, and with minor daily changes, the risk is considered to be low. During the last day, the stock moved $2.71, 1.48%, between high and low. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 1.24%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Apple, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price to earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per share earnings. This is a relatively normal P-E ratio, often seen in businesses with long track records or predictable revenues. In other news, the next earnings report for Q2 2023 is expected on July 27, 2023. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $1.19. Keep an eye on these numbers, as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Apple. There's no significant resistance from accumulated volume above, which means the stock could move upward swiftly under the right conditions. In this case, you might want to enter a position and use volume to determine when to exit. On the downside, Apple encounters its first support level at $179.58. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Apple from multiple analyst sources is strong buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On May 16, 2023, Young Andrea conducted an insider sell of 68,642 shares of common stock. On May 10, 2023, Adams Catherine L. conducted an insider sell of 2,900 shares of common stock. On May 8, 2023, Condo Chris conducted an insider sell of 4,092 shares of common stock. On April 15, 2023, Condo Chris conducted an insider buy of 10,792 shares of common stock. On April 15, 2023, Condo Chris conducted an insider sell of 4,384 shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of minus 37.788. Overall, insiders purchased 1,451,037 shares and sold 3,312,807 shares in the last 100 trades. 
Our recommended stop loss is set at $179.76, minus 3.36%. This stock has low daily movements and this gives low risk. The RSI 14 is 82 and this increases the risk substantially. There is a buy signal from a pivot bottom found 45 days ago. Is Apple stock a good buy? Apple holds several positive signals, but we still don't find these to be enough for a buy candidate. At the current level, it should be considered as a hold candidate, hold or accumulate, in this position whilst awaiting further development. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a strong buy to a hold slash accumulate candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Friday, June 16th, we expect Apple to open down $0.568 and start trading at $185.44. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.